The Algol family of solid fuel rocket stages and boosters built by Aerojet, now Aerojet Rocketdyne and used on a variety of launch vehicles. It was developed by Aerojet from the earlier Jupiter Senior and the Navy Polaris programs. Upgrades to the Algol motor occurred from 1960 till the retirement of the Scout launch vehicle in 1994. Solid propellant rocket stage. Loaded mass 10,705 kg. Thrust 470.93 kN vacuum specific impulse 236 sex variations Algol I, ID, 2, EA, EBA popular rating was 40 kilo Siemens minus 115,000 52,000 kg force for 40 seconds, also known as Senior. They were initially developed as the first stage motor of the Scout rocket. The design was based on the UGM-27 Polaris, a submarine-launched ballistic missile developed for the United States Navy at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory. <laughs> Algol-1 XM-68 Algol-1 XM-68 This rocket design started as the Polaris test motor, 31 feet in length with a 40 inches meters diameter steel case, and 86,000 pound of thrust. The eventual UGM-27 Polaris A1 was larger, 28.5 feet (8.7 meters) in length and 54 inches (1.4 meters) in diameter. The Algol-1 was first used for a successful suborbital launch of a Scout X-1 rocket on September 2, 1960. This rocket started as a UGM-27 Polaris test motor with a 40-inch diameter, which at the time was the largest solid motor ever tested. It had a nominal performance rating of 45 seconds duration and 45,000 kg force thrust. It was 19.42 feet meters long, 2.6 feet meters in diameter, and had a burn time of 27 seconds. Scaled up to 1.02 meters in diameter. Later versions for Scout D scaled to 1.14 meters, 45 in. Algol 1 oust on the Scout X Cub Scout test flight flown April 18, 1960, served as prototype vehicle for eventual Scout rocket. Algol 1 bust on Scout X1, Room 89 Blue Scout I, and Room 90 Blue Scout II. Algol 1 cused on the Scout X1A. After this single flight, the Scout X-2 with Algol 1D replaced this prototype. Algol 1 used with Scout X-2, Scout X-2M and Little Joe 2, solid rocket stage. 440.00 kN lbf thrust. Mass 10,700 kg 23,600 pounds. It was first used on the Scout X-2 on March 29, 1962. It continued to be used on Scout X-2 and Scout X-2M launches four until 1963. Algol-1D was first used on the Little Joe 2 qualification test vehicle in 1963. May 13, 1964 Algol boosts Little Joe 2 A001 flight. An Aerojet-built Algol 1D heavy-duty rocket motor performed successfully for the 36th consecutive time on May 13, 1964 as it carried a NASA Little Joe 2 spacecraft on the Apollo program A001 test flight. Averaging 96,650 pounds thrust, the Algol 1D was the largest solid rocket motor flying in non-military space programs. Test hardware on May's successful Apollo test flight included, an unmanned instrumented command module, service module, launch escape system and the Little Joe 2 launch system. Algol engine used on Little Joe 2 Thrust, 465 kN each Length, 9.1 m Diameter, 1 m Weight full, 10,180 kg Weight empty, 1,900 kg Fuel, solid Burn time, 40 s Status, retired 1966
Gross mass, 10,700 kg, 23,600 pounds. Unfueled mass, 1,200 kg, 2,600 pounds. Height, 9.40 meters, 30.8 feet. Diameter, 1.02 meters, 3.3 feet. Thrust, 440.00 kN, 98,910 lbf. Burn time, 44 s. Number, 20. Topic Algol 2 The Algol 2, Algol 2 series was first flown in 1962. It was used a first stage on Scout A, Scout B, Scout X3, Scout X4. It was proposed as a strap on motor for the Titan 3 BAS 2 variant. Cancelled. It was also proposed for the Athena RTX program in 1969, losing to Thickle. B165488, Jan. 17, 1969 Thrust SL, 513.300 kN, 115,394 lbf, 52,347 kg force. The 3BAS-2 configuration of Titan 3B rocket proposed by Martin in the mid-1960s would have been used for deep space missions with a Centaur upper stage, Algol strap-on for liftoff thrust augmentation. It was never flown. CSD solid rocket engine. 564.2 kN. ISP equals 255s. Gross mass, 11,600 kg, 25,600 pounds. Unfueled mass, 1,650 kg, 3,640 pounds. Height, 9.09 meters, 29.8 feet. Diameter, 1.01 meters, 3.3 feet. Thrust, 564.20 kN, 126,837 lbf. Specific impulse, 255 s. Specific impulse sea level, 232 s. The Algol EA was introduced in 1963 using the Aerojet 40 kilo Siemens motor. It first flew on Scout X3 in 1963. The Algol EB was created after an Algol EA flight failure. The nozzle was designed and designate the EB model. It first flew on Scout X4 the Algol EC flew on Scout A1 and B1. Scout A2, B2, C and minus 2 versions planned for Algol EC were never used. <laughs> Algol 3 In 1972, the Algol 3 was developed by the Chemical Systems Division of United Technologies. The Algol 3 was a new high performance solid rocket motor developed for use as the first stage of the NASA Scout D and E launch vehicles. It was first flown on Scout D 1 in 1972. The motor diameter was increased 45 inches, 1.1 meters, providing 104,500 pounds thrust. This was a 30% improvement of lifting capacity versus the Algol EB. The motor delivers a 30% gain in total impulse over its predecessor and provides a 35-45% gain in payload mass capability at a fractional increase in cost. Algol 3 has successfully completed development and qualification at United Technology Center under contract to LTV Aerospace Corps Vought Missiles and Space Co., the Scout Prime contractor for the NASA Langley Research Center. The Scout X-2 which in 1962 introduced the Antares IIB stage upgrade. On 23 August 1962 a Scout X-2 was used for the first successful launch of a DMSP satellite, lifting off from Point Argulo near Vandenberg Air Force Base, 9, 10. The Scout X-3 which in 1963 introduced the Algol IIA upgrade. The Scout A-1 and B-1 which in 1965 introduced the Castor IIA and Altair 3 upgrades, respectively. The Scout D-1 which in 1972 introduced the Algol 3 upgrade. The Scout G flew from 1974 until the Scout's retirement in 1994. It was rated to orbit a 210 kg payload. Algol 
Topic. See also. UGM27 Polaris. Graphite epoxy motor. Little Joe. Scout rocket family. Vega rocket. <laughs>